no win. I got the game running, but it cuts its audio off as soon as I hit mouse off, so I'm just refreshing my pages to see if they're valid and working. Apparently they're good. Correct name? Okay, let's go. So I was gonna stream yesterday and take today off because my uh, eye appointment might take a little bit longer, but instead uh, I took yesterday off and streamed today because my eye appointment was fine. It was fast. And I still have some dye, I can't tell, but <laughs> I think they've gotten used to it. But they did, they did a good set of eye tests on me today. Slightly increased my uh, prescription, and I guess in two weeks ish, I'll probably get some new glasses. Not sure exactly what ones I'm gonna get or wear yet, but uh, I think I'll probably try to stay a similar style to this with just the feet on them instead so I can actually adjust it properly. It's, it's toasty in here. And in two weeks, I'll adjust the room a little bit to turn the setup, and then I'll have access to the window there properly. I'm going to turn the AC down, and I'm going to have a drink. fucking ass mission last time, so thank god it's done. It's okay, Captain. And so Princess Cordelia returned. You wanna come up? Through the efforts of Militia Squad 7. Its leader <laughs> was celebrated as rescuer to the nation's sovereign. And awarded the prestigious Gallian Medal. <laughs> no, but pets. Just some head scratches. Okay. Lieutenant Welkin Gunther, step forward. <laughs> Sir. This echo is so hilarious. Valor and deed, you are hereby awarded this honor. Your Highness, please bestow the medal upon the young. Gladly. Congratulations, Lieutenant. Thank you, Your Highness. Though I have yet to reach an answer, your question drives me still. To understand my responsibility as sovereign and as a single human life. And know that one tradition already lies sundered by my will. I had the cooks add cinnamon rolls to my daily breakfast. Alicia will be happy to hear it. Would you? Lieutenant Gunther, you forget no, 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 yourself. No, no, no. What do you want to chomp on my fingers for, huh? Sir, my apologies. Sorry, Cleo's being needy. With this, today's ceremonies are ended. Highness, would you grace us with a word? Lieutenant Gunther, I hope your allegiance to Galia stands you can go, Cleo. You're very cute. Yes, Princess. Something more I have not told you. You are clear. Please be safe. <laughs> Did 
get wrecked. You good girl. Welcome. I'm coming in. The kids sure, here. It's open. Ooh, is that it? Not bad, man. You sure made a name for yourself this time. It was pure luck I was there. So have you seen the headlines? The ones that say nothing about the kidnap? That reporter tells me Borg's the one pressuring the media into suppressing it. But why suppress it? If word got out about what happened, Galia's relationship with the Federation would suffer. We've got our hands full fending off the Empire. We can't afford a war on two fronts. My nose. I tried moisturizing my face today. I don't think I have good moisturizer for. Ow, 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 ow. Wake you up! You want my attention that bad? Okay, fine. Okay, so Left he has hand the whole on thing you. Covered up. I'll bet he goes on acting like it never happened. She's a good girl, Cleo. Got my hand wrapped up tight. Welcome, this hurts. It's painfully obvious how shaky Galia's standing is. I know the world's history is an endless chain of big fish eating little fish. Both of us know the weak bow to the strong. It's history and it's nature. A minor nation like ours is an easy mark, even before you add the rift within our army. Welcome, no offense, but I hope nature's wrong this time. I don't know what to tell you, Faldio. <laughs> Chapter 10. Liberation of Thousand. Frozen. Frozen. Decoration stab. So in condition to the game here. Any decorations? May view any awards you've earned in the decoration stab. Open the live button, but Rudra Chief's decoration to be in what's that condition? Audience hall via the headquarters tab with Princess Cordelia presented to you in person. <laughs> You're so cute, Cleo. She's got her, her arms wrapped around my hand like this on mission. both sides. She just has, has my hand like around her like neck and she's just like leaning into it and happily purring. Thousands, that big industrial city with all those ragnite mines, right? Yes. If we manage to reclaim it, it'll be a shot in the arm to Galia's productivity. Sounds good. So what's the plan, boss? The militia will break up into squads and set up a perimeter around the city. You should go clear. Once that's set, Squad 7 takes the point. Here. Look at this. Oh yeah, they're trained. An armored rail vehicle? Right. They installed it to defend their hold on the city. Now our mission is to destroy it. Yeah, okay, so we destroy it. Any idea how we take on a beast like that? It's gonna take a lot more than a pack of soldiers marching at it to do that, boss. Don't worry, we've got some hefty support on this one. Oh, thank you for the subscription, Solar. How's it going? How's it going, man? I picked up Triangle Strategy. I was playing it yesterday, <laughs> or day before yesterday. You know that Darksons from Empire-held areas have been brought there. What is up, Kuiyo? She let my arm go, Kit Kat. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta say hi to people. Let my arm go. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> ow, ow. Why are you bleeding so hard? Did I actually? Uh, I got into, I think, chapter four? I'm not quite sure. The part where you choose to... Uh... Oh, no worries, man. I've been busy. Moving, starting work back up and stuff, so... 
So good. What's up, Quill? There come you. You're being rowdy and putting me down. You gonna attack me? Is that what you're doing? He's being rowdy today. <laughs> but yeah, I got to the part where, uh... My, uh... You get to choose which city to go to. And I went to the church city. And solved the problem there. And then I don't remember what's happening next, but, uh... It's good. It's very story-heavy. The combat stuff is great, though, so... I'm quite enjoying that part of it quite a lot. I've heard stories, yes. And then, uh, not this next paycheck, but the one on the 15th or so, I'll pick up a uh, project, or er, Unicorn Overload as well. But I'm not sure which system I'm going to play it on yet, because it's not on PC, which makes it a little frustrating. I'm going to have to set up my, <laughs> my PS4 recording station, so. According to Captain Varat, one of the men in the camps is acting as our yeah. agent. No worries about disappearing for a while. That's all good as long as you're uh, you're doing well yourself. Here I get my hopes up, and it's just some dark hair. Got any more great news? Yeah, I'm enjoying the game quite a bit. The combat is good. The story's pretty good. I I do have some grievances with the the voices though. <laughs> the the main guy particularly, I can't stand his voice. It's uh, saying, it's I not my favorite for sure. It looks so much like Octopath that when I'm I'm expecting like the Octopath level voices and and uh, characters, and that main guy is not great. <laughs> He's got like a voice that's like too young and too old at the same time, and I don't know how to describe it, but the way he talks and reads his lines like pisses me off a little bit but luckily everybody else talks a lot too so it's not so bad please stop judging people solely by your preconceptions all dark sins are different sure could have fooled me i couldn't tell you dark hairs apart if i tried welcome to anime racism in world war one <laughs> or world war two technically i guess you have ever really tried rosie no, you just didn't. Just drop it already. We're soldiers. We'll do our best out there. If the orders say work with a Darkson, we do. That said, I ain't making any promises that this guy turns out to be useless. Here. Well, we can't. I'd almost prefer it if they had funnier the voices, <laughs> like if they were a little more unique or a little more like cartoonish. It's like four or five of them that I would expect to be like an evil minister with like a weird, like, yeah, don't worry, I will make sure things go along well between the countries. He's like a little too normal about it instead, so it's just like, this guy just sounds like a dude. The attack begins at sundown. But then the main guy's like, he's got like a little bit of a lisp, and he's got this like, really naive, like boy who just got out of puberty voice I'm just like oh god I hate him makes me like don't worry father I will do the thing for you and I'm like oh oh god why is he the main character but uh, I like the choices being able to choose like different paths at different points and like how your character acts to like different people that you come up to is really cool there's a lot of nice interactions that I, I'm enjoying in it, so. Oh, this stench is unbearable. Please, some food, sir. Even water would. Anime World War II Nazi camps, essentially. Keep your distance. Presumptuous, dark haired, filthy. Where is the one responsible for this hovel? You rang? Uh, tank guy. I hear a worker in Sector D has been disobeying his work orders. Would you care to explain this infraction? He's not disobeying you. He's been sick as a dog for a couple of days now. Folks from other camps working D Sector have gotten sick lately too. One's in a coma. 
I agree with you. Most of the score games are pretty good story-wise at the very least, so... That's where they handle Ragnite Refinery. Sure the toxic exhaust's being handled right? When you want to cuddle again, Cleo? You were being all feisty, though. I'm not going to pick you back up. It's chilling down by my leg there. <laughs> That's no concern of yours or mine. You animals need only be silent and obey. Cat fluff. Okay. Yeah, not. Yeah, maybe this weekend actually. I will go through and spend Saturday or something reorganizing here. Rotate my room a little bit, then I have access to the nice big window for airflow. Maybe a little bit more space. I'm not quite sure if that's gonna work though, but we'll see. Let's think of it this way. You drive them to death and the work stops getting done. That doesn't help you much, eh? Hmm. I'll let you know as soon as he can work. Think you could let him rest for now? What's your cue? <laughs> Very well. Have him return to work the minute he's able. And remember, no one would miss the likes of a few of you maggots. Or I do anything else. Let's see what's available here. New desert skirmish. Oh, lots of personnel updates. Okay. Lover of nature since childhood. His free time is spent observing animal and plant life near his home. He's credited with discovering six new insect species. A natural tinker. Hobbies include collecting tools. The wrench set will consent to celebrate her entrance to high school. It remains particularly dear to her. I've already read the name, so I'm not going to go through all of just the new paragraphs. Born a Rangazer, he personified Blith Charm and Gregarious Warmth. In Wilkins' words, every girl on campus knew him by name and reputation. Oops. Some of these I read last time, actually. Like, uh, the avid reader, her private quarters of sea books ranging from economic treatises to children's literature. One local bookshop owes it to her, her its livelihood. Her hobbies include cards, which she picked up while working her bar job. She often played with Faldio, winning ten games to his five. <clears throat> the owner of a legendary sweet tooth. He adds three heaping tables of sugar to his hot milk. Gross. Uh, co-workers say he keeps chocolate hidden on him at all times. His insistence on testing everything he developed resulted in quality work, in one instance of him accidentally driving a tank full, full board to a civilian home. Current heiress to the Grand Greece line of Archdukes are ruled the nation. At the age of 16, she stands at the figurehead of Galia and the scion of the Valkyrie. Martis von Borg. Marquis, head of House Borg, and Prime Minister of Galia, age 68, currently acts as regent to the young Princess Cordelia, handling affairs in her stead. He rose to the post as commander thanks to Borg's recommendation. Exceptionally proud of his noble birth, he considers the common militiamen disposable. I can't wait till that guy gets fucking killed. Friendship with Professor Tamer was supposedly so close that even the typical taciturn Gunther walked, talked up a storm when the two were together. I don't know why they don't have an image of him. He has a photo. Though the owner of an uncommon talent and author of several brilliant theses, his, uh... Darks and heritage prevented him from working at the major industrial firms. Jin Townsend, diplomat, diplomat in the Federation Foreign Ministry, age 45, appointed to lead the diplomatic mission at Gallia at an uncommonly young age. Uh, Cordelia's kidnapping is decided upon in secret by the Federation's High Council and enacted by Townsend and a cadre of elite operatives. Though his affable demeanor dis suggested a temperate personality, reports describe him as a perfectionist willing to take any means necessary to achieve his aims. <clears throat> no need tanks. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to read all these, so I'll just pause it for two seconds. People can look at it later. The, the whole glossary is, is a lot. <laughs> but I appreciate the detail they went into to writing up like this fictional history here. One weapon, so, uh, sorry, one metal. In my old PS4 
3 version of this game. I have this all filled out, but uh, I'm not going to go for a perfect set of runs on this one. Take too long. I'm going to have to probably redo it with Here's all the like maxed characters. <laughs> Good for you, man, I guess. <laughs> Open a window. Intelligence reporting imperial activity in the area. This is your starting position. So you can quickly drive the strike force back. Occupy the base camp. Good luck. Cool. It's a good field. Questions? Let's get started. I get a weird I wish you good luck. <laughs> Happy hunting. Let's drive so how's uh, your prep for election belly. stuff coming Squad down seven, that way? Got all your voter registration stuff set up? Yeah, it's gonna be a an odd one for sure. I just hope it doesn't like influence the Canadian election too much. Up here, definitely tend to take a little bit of inspiration from the one down there. Whoa! He's taking shots at her. Oh, she missed. Scout's pretty close, I see. Matter Lancer over there. Oh shit, I left that sniper going there. Entering combat. Hank. I would do that, but Mark is definitely been quite divided for the last decade. Yeah, definitely. Uh, it's not that it like spills over in like a real obvious way. It's more like right-wing politicians up here really take after Trump because they think it's the way to make things succeed. Like we have a a very similar equivalent to Trump up here, which is like, the best way I like to describe him is fascist millhouse. He's a uh, very much a douchebag, very much like a, a grifter going for the, the most common thing he can, basically, like, if it works down in the States, I'll do it up here too, and like, he somehow became the leader of the Conservative Party up here, which is the, the right-wing equivalent for it up here. It's just, just baffling. <laughs> Go for a headshot. Get lucky. Not a headshot, but that's good. Don't stray too far from the squad. Oh, wait, you say Canada as a whole, Lanes? 
Uh, it's more left than the American side, but uh, we're... I don't think Canada or the States particularly falls any more left than center, so... Like, even in the States, when they say the left and the right, they're both, like, on the right side of that, that whole thing. <laughs> like, they're not particularly acting any, like, really super socialist or, uh, like, federalist policies or anything, like, really super strong for the Green Party or, um, yeah, anything particularly... particularly left. So, like, Canada is closer to, like, center on the, the whole thing. States, the Democrats and Republicans are both pretty far into the, the right side of that spectrum. We're definitely more liberal and more socialist than the states. But not that much. <laughs> Let's see if I can get a grenade off to kill this guy. Ow. Oh, it's gonna hit the fucking thing, isn't it? Oh, it didn't. Nice. Good job. I don't like leaving that sniper up to take shots at my two snipers there, but... Moving everybody up first is more important at the moment. It's a miss. Fall back now. Oh, Claudia, I'll take pot shots at him at that guy with her. That's pretty neat. Jump. Don't want to give up your gun rights. <laughs> Well, like, we have guns in Canada, too, but not, like, not to the the worshipping extent they do down in the States there, like... Nobody really in North America needs that kind of, like, crazy Medic. Medic. stuff that's going on down in the States. Enemy unit spotted. Oh, shit. Ran out of movement right there, right? Eh? Get some lucky headshots. Go for it. Fuck. <laughs> Let's just hope nobody comes over to get her there. No more shit, but I have an extensive collection I enjoy shooting. See, I, I get that too. But, like... I've always had, like, a 22... Like, I don't have one now, because I, I live in a city with, you know, apartment and stuff. But, like, we had a 22... Uh, a rifle and like a shotgun back home all registered for uh, hunting and stuff and my parents showed me how to use them they were both in the militia and they do training exercises and stuff like that all the time with them but like you just don't need them and if you want to shoot for hunting or for sport you can get the licenses to do that but like carrying a gun day to day there's no reason for it oh fuck As long as they don't take out Oscar, too, she can, uh, get rescued. Ow. She shoots back into the rock. God damn it. How's my weight loss going? Uh, definitely up a little bit, but not much. Mostly just because, like, the, the moving here, getting back into work and stuff has, like, killed my free time for exercise, so... And I don't have the space in this part of the new apartment to uh, <coughs> do the exercise on stream anymore, so I'm trying to figure that out. But it'll probably be a couple weeks. Oh, fuck, they're hitting the tank pretty hard here. Uh, <coughs> and then I'll probably just try to do more, like, streams. Woof, Oscar survived. Uh, more uh, prep for like outdoor streams and, and streams when I go to like bike and stuff like that walk around the city and whatnot and stream but that's gonna be at least uh, fuck my tank is taking a beating 
Nah, yeah, well, my tank's blown up. Oh, he hit the treads. Okay, I'm very lucky. <laughs> now he's going again. No. Oh. I think that means I have to restart this one. Uh, yeah. Oh, God damn it. Wow, they fucking beat the shit out of it that time. Normally they're, uh... Maybe they got some upgraded <laughs> weapons in this one for their anti-tank stuff. Look some for the last time. Uh, I'm, uh, so I've lost like a little bit of muscle mass, I think, in the last couple months. It's like I and I have lost weight in like the arms and the legs a bit, but the belly has gone up, and I think that's because of the type of exercise that has been going on for me. Instead of going ex full exposed there, I'm gonna... Oh, oh, no. I got stuck on the thing. You can all do this. Stay strong. Shit. I have to move the tank again. I don't particularly care about that guy shoot me with his rifle there. Alright, now that he's stood up. Just block this guy in. There we go. A little bit of cover from the walls from those other Lancer guys over there. out for the other snipers. <laughs> Save me trouble of having to rescue them again. Yeah, I want to pick up a new camera for doing uh, the IRL streaming. Which I, I have one picked out. But I'm still trying to like safely budget myself a little bit and like pay down uh, credit cards and stuff. So it'll all get into get into it eventually. support closer if I can. No! Fuck! Okay. Get ready. First credit card, paying off fully tweaked. Nice. Yeah, I, I've had two or three, I think, across my life. And my turn, okay? the first one I, I kept pretty good, and then I got a new one for college, but uh, Near the end of college, it kind of got out of control. So I paid it off, cancelled it, and then I, I kept the current one. The smaller one I got rid of. <sighs> and I was doing pretty good until the strike stuff came through, and then I ended up using it more when I needed to, so... It is what it is. That's what they're there for. You know, helping you and the times are tough, but... Uh, Still doesn't feel good to have a lot of credit card debt, so it's one of my main goals to like pay back quicker than than not. We're sending units out to both sides. Ooh, three shots, could you do it? Nice. I'm on a roll. Target silenced. Head to the next one. 
Yeah, the the particulars of like Shock Trooper there might be a little spicy. <laughs> it was like COVID, and there was some government help, and I was moved in with a friend, and I, I was working near the end of it, but like there was a lot of like financial stress that like ruined my past couple of years of like paying down my student debts and like credit cards and getting everything good back in order. So by the end of it, I was like desperate to work again. And then the first the two, good two years here, I like paid it all back, got into a good spot, and then it was like, okay, look, oh fuck, she got fucked up. Just my luck. The the industry goes on strike for a year and like puts everybody into tight financial spots. So, but uh, we're all working. Well, not all of us. A bunch of us are working again. I'm in a good spot to catch back up again, so... Oh, fuck. Good snipers. And the Lancer, his accuracy was crazy. That one's... Point blank, he can't miss. Got out from behind cover, ran a little bit, <laughs> then got back into cover and ended turn. Woo! Close. Damn. Get another shot at her. Oh, oh. Yeah, these Lancers must have uh, souped up damage on the new weapons they have. They're they're killing dudes left and right here. Ow. Damage. Ow. Oh boy. Okay. On the move now. Snipers are shit at running, but... Stupid Imperials. Good shot. Yes! But yeah, I gave myself a pretty tight budget uh, with the plan of going towards Japan next year in May for EVO. Uh, and I think I can do it. But I, it does mean I have to stay pretty tight on my, my personal budget, so we'll see what I can do for, for keeping things fun and exciting for streams. But I have a lot of good backlog games to play at the very least, I guess. So I'll make do with those what I can. <laughs> Can you make it there, Largo? Your movement is just shit, so. Spotted an enemy. Medic! Sit tight. Help's almost there. Rosie, babe, talk to me. I'd also like to go to Vegas Evo as well, but Medic! the Japan Evo is something I'd much rather do. So that's going to be my focus for the moment. Stay strong. Keep Save up, go to that, get paid up into a good position, and, uh, Just stay calm and get it done. try to keep this guy up. Let's headshot him. Oh. And kill him, though. Fuck. Okay. Mm -hmm. Entering Tank up. Set up the little mines. I'll go up on it. Seven headshots to kill him. Uh, nice. Retreat. 
to rely on the snipers. Man, I don't even know if they can make it in three turns, but... I... If nothing else, maybe I could take out their sniper. Nice. Good shot, Marina. Sweet dreams. Who are these guys? Oh, their movement is so bad. New prey sighted. Okay. One more move, and she could probably get a snipe on that guy over there. Hunt begins. Biggest hit. Nice, good shot. Sweet dreams. Good. That makes things a bit easier. No, she's so close. <laughs> Damn it. Fine. I'll waste another movement on her. Begins. There we go. Man down. They'll make it. That's a promise. <sighs> Medic's Run working fast, hard. Medic. Next turn, I'll have to summon reinforcements. Scattered on the field here. My Ow. That should be his only bullet. He used three last turn, and they only recover one per turn cycle, so... Whoa! Good job surviving, Oscar. You gonna take out Oscar? Yeah. Ah! Uh. Please. Oh shit! Shock trooper, right? Oh good, he's not going for the sniper. <laughs> oh, he is, actually, but... I, he went, like, straight on for her. He'll be okay, I'll rescue him, probably. Oof. As long as the enemy doesn't run up and touch them, they, like, finish them off, then... You can usually rescue them. If you get to them within, like, two turns, the medic can keep them alive. But, uh... These guys are dealing out like crazy damage, but it's good for its skirmish. Good practice. Jesus! <laughs> it's like I gotta kill the sniper. Let's just put all of the all of my movement into killing this one sniper. She survived though, that's good. Uh Here we go. Idle Vice. Fuck that guy up. There's tanks farther away there, but uh we'll be there in a minute. Enemy sighted them. Yeah, I cannot enter. I know, I know. Hostile sighted. Try to stay sharp. This for but cover. Get back home alive. Coordinates locked. Distance 500 meters. He's not looking. There we go. Good. That makes things a bit easier. The tank guy can't shoot back, so I'm not too worried about him at the moment. <sighs> she could probably make it to about there. Probably have to send Marina to go rescue Oscar first. Maybe she can take a pot shot at that sniper on the roof. 
But she made it nice. Even though he's in cover. Sit tight. Help's almost there. Run fast, medic. Nothing personal. Good shot. Oscar was pulling bitches. <laughs> Get okay. Elise into the fight as well. Gonna need those anti tank guys sooner than later. Assuming they don't get fucking sniped here, but get fucked. There we go. There are shock troopers, three tanks. Pretty sure there's a hidden guy over here. I got it. Get as close as you can, Eddie. Not bad, but ooh, she's in the open air. Get ready. So they're gonna have reinforcements coming in at this base. I've got some coming at my old base. And once I capture this one, I'll call in some new guys. Ow. Shoot back, Eddie. No, I can't. It's a fucking sniper up there. Oh god, Marina's gonna get taken out by the sniper. <laughs> no! Oh, he's gonna shoot at Eddie. Or not. Just crouch in a more exposed position. Alright. Alright, Alicia and Rosie are back. They might sergeants, so they get extra Let's command points. Move a couple more times at the very least. Well, you can't even see the. Damn it. Okay, fine. Alicia is the superstar okay. runner here, so. Have her hoof it all the way over to the base. Right. Strike when you see an opening. Please don't light up on the offense. Oh, shit. Damn it. The hunt begins. Still two full shots to kill that guy. Four to kill that guy. Gonna be more of a problem actively, so. Hurry with that reload, they're getting away. Mm -hmm. He's out of view there at the very least. My turn, okay? Good. Keep your eyes peeled. Wonderful work. Please continue as you are. Oh, I can't aim up further. Fuck. The objective ASAP. Oh no. No! Uh, can she make it over without killing herself? Let's find out. I don't think it's gonna go up on top. No! No! Enemy unit spotted. Fuck. <laughs> Grenaded herself. Uh, oh, she's gonna be like right in the way of the stairs too. Uh. Still, fuck. Just watch this. 
the tank buster guys have like the worst ass movement, so. I just ain't feeling it here. Hit the sandbag, maybe we'll keep him out of cover. Boom. And he just missed like hugely, so never mind. Pull them both off the roof. Oh, got them both. Man nice. Down. I like that. Okay. Case. Okay, chance exposing the tank a little bit to the other tanks. Okay. Reinforcements over there. Okay. Ow! Oh my god, that did a lot. Holy fuck. Oh, they only took the one shot. Thank god. I'll try my best. Fix that tank. Tank. This game, Valkyria Chronicles. Thank you. It's a Sega game from like 2008, 2009. Very, very unique, and uh, I very much like the like kind of turn-based military strategy aspect of it. But they made it on PS3, and then Valkyria Chronicles 2 and 3 were on the PSP, weirdly, and then. Uh, they put out like a spin-off game called Valkyria Revolutions, which was like a really bad Devil May Cry action game with a guy with a sword for some reason. And it was so terrible. But then they heard the fans get pissed off about it, so they made Valkyria Chronicles 4 on PS4. And that game was fantastic, so. Entering combat. Oh, is David in here? I didn't see him talk if he was. <laughs> oh, I got stuck. Uh oh. Fuck you there. Okay, stay behind cover. A little bit. This one's got the most clean shots on me. Oh, I hit the treads. Shit. Can't enter the trench, so I gotta go that way. We're under fire here, requesting backup. Do all you can to minimize casualties. The viewers list? <laughs> uh, maybe he's just watching, not doing anything yet. He usually comes in midway through streams. Okay. I think uh, my streams tend to work out with his like wow time, so. It's a good time for him to just watch and hang out and then chat when he's not doing stuff. Hey, she hit it. Fantastic. How are the views doing? Oh, pretty good. Sandy comes in every now and then and cries a little bit about his uh, poor luck with men. But he was sick recently and he uh, covered, so... I hit it and did no damage. What the hell? And Crimson. Let's do this thing. And Shadow and a couple of the other guys are all still doing well as well. It's like. Oh, this 
place is a dust rotates through who's here most of the time though. <laughs> What's your situation? Oh her movement's so bad too. God damn it. I can see that guy right there. Here I come. Yeah, he tries. Usually that's his thing. He's like, hey, how's it going? I'm doing good. Blah, 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 blah. You should be into men. <laughs> I'm like, all right, man. It's just usually his, his like opening line, and then he then he's normal for the rest of it. But the tenacity is is a thing, but. <laughs> Barking up a tree that's gonna get him nothing. Ah! Oh. I got it. Oh hell, the Ado has to help me out. Then she could kill him. Sure. I go. Tank fire killed it in like two hits. That was the high daddy prison. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> that seems to be a pretty common one now. Ooh, that's a lot of mines there. Get a good shot on that tank. Down. Hey, good hit. I can make you impact, yeah. <laughs> well, triangle strategy is at least 50% your doing, so. Thank you for triangle strategy. <laughs> Ow. Oh my god, are they gonna just burn all their ammo on their snipers? Thanks. Whoa! Underminer oh. fire! Oh no worries, man. No, I wanted to get the I like both Triangle Strategy Underminer and fire. Unicorn Overlord were games that were like on my list, so it wasn't a hard pressure to to get me to go pick those up. So <laughs> here we go. Yeah, man, the, the damage of the anti-tank guys in this one is crazy. They're beating my tank the fuck up. Be ready for an ambush, soldiers. In fact, like I normally. Take this ahead further, but I'm gonna back it up for a turn here. Huh. Biggest life change for me as the every first apartment. Ah, nice. Right. I remember you said you were you were looking at moving last time. Not a bad heal. Watch your surroundings. Cover. You find a good one, or was it more of a I'm settling situation? Alicia's still a little fucked up, so that's okay. Ooh, can she get that sniper from over here? Out of range, damage wise, but. Good shot, though. Avoid any hasty decision, Oops. Oh, I blew up the, the, the cover on the roof there, so. He's probably safe from the sniper there. Now he can see her. Sight lines blocked by some of the rocks. He's maybe okay. Uh, anti tank guys first. Let's go. Q. 
kill it. Ah, oh, you fuck. Good one, great price too. Nice. Roger. This one's definitely nice, but still a little on the expensive side. And uh, I've already butted heads with management on a couple random things. Not like bad things, mostly just like they don't want to accept payment on debit and stuff like that. But uh, other than that, I enjoy the place quite a bit, even though it's still like not quite done construction yet. It'll be uh, it'll be a good one for the next year at the least, and then I'll see what my situation's coming up like in the in the studio. Too far. How many hits to kill the sniper from a mile away? Probably a couple hundred. <laughs> No sandstorm activating in this one. Maybe it's because I haven't crossed the line yet, but... The hunt begins. Get to cover. Oh, she's out of bullets. Oh, fuck. Okay. Do, 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 do. Ryan's voice. You can just hear his voice easy straight out. <laughs> Your mate's been decent? Good. It's always a pain in the ass when your roommates aren't something you, you get along with very well. Like, I, I can live and work with anybody. Uh, it's always just like... I have no problem adjusting to, uh, to most people and like their way of life and stuff, but if they can't take care of themselves, clean up, pay the bills on time and stuff... <sighs> That gets to be an annoyance, but most people are like that, I find. Most people are pretty normal. They'll clean up their, their dishes, they'll do their laundry, clean the washroom, split the chores up kind of thing. And then it's not so bad. Oh, they're just coming in calling more snipers. God, bad aim, sniper fucker. Three shots, one hit. Okay. Four shots, one hit. Damage minimal. Yeah, as long as that's the only tank that can get a clean shot on me. I don't think that ever hits her there. It seems like she's right behind the the sand dune in a good spot. <coughs> Entering combat. Tank go. Light of ice. See, I. I hope they either make a really good Gundam action game or a Gundam game with this kind of like strategic combat would be really fantastic. Can I pop a thing over at them? Too far. Kill that thing. Ding. But like, the age of the lumbering Gundams of the UC area, with this kind of gameplay would be fantastic. I would very much enjoy that. Uh, tank guys first. If they can take the tank out, we're in a good spot. Ooh, there we go. If she misses one, maybe she can hit the other. Oh, 
Oh, she fills the ammo up. Nice. Go on then. That's a good potential to have trigger. Good hit. There we go. Good. That makes things a bit easier. I just gotta worry about the snipers. Be here till another hour and a bit at the very least. Enemy attack. All units brace for it. Oh. Ah, I left her in a bad spot because of that. Fuck. Alright. Let's move the tank up. See if I can't mortar those snipers. Oh, I already used the. Nope, she refilled. Me. Nice. We've got another cut. Oh yeah, there we go. That's the good stuff. One sniper down. Blocking the sight line of the other one. I might be able okay. to make a pretty good use of that. Is there a secret guy? I can't tell. Get ready! Yep, Quio, what's up? Snipers. <laughs> Bro, there's no way that hits her. She can't even shoot back over that sand, dude. When she stands up, others. Maybe the maybe he doesn't see the sand, dude, for something for some reason. <laughs> there's no way he's heading her down there. <laughs> Jump up, Cleo. Come on. Come on. Here you go, good girl. Had to make it very clear to her that she could jump up. Nothing personal. 
Ah, she hit him in like the collarbone. Badger. Badger. With a airhead voice. Nice, good shot, Elise. Now, can you see? Hidden guy, if there is one over here. Nope. Not one there. I got it. Oh, there isn't. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, is he in cover? Fuck. Ow. Ah, oh, he's crouching. Fuck me. <laughs> Shock Trooper's just at about range to be able to actually shoot at her. Alright, super early show, let's go. Keep the Shock Trooper at a distance. Occupy because he's there. The hunt begins. I'll give Alicia a little bit of help so she doesn't get wasted in return fire if she doesn't kill this guy. Good cat. Sweet dreams. My turn, okay? What's up, Cleo Cat? Mm -hmm. Operation complete. Definitely, yeah, not a, not a good rank on that one. My guys got killed several times, I had to revive, or medic them out, and took several turns to capture. What's up, Cleo? If I do come back to re-up those, I'll do that on my own time. <laughs> Alright, headquarters, please. Oh, the echo is so bad. Very well, Lieutenant Gunther. And it's not like it's overdone. If it was the volume, it was that, but their voices were up 50%, it would sound less like we're 20 feet away recording them in an echoey hall. I thank you again for the valor you showed in assisting me that night. Not at all. I was just relieved to see you were unharmed, Highness. It wasn't until I saw my friends gawk at that metal realized how special it was. No, me too. What's so cool you can't, hmm? Me too. Maybe being a little sassy, sassy, sassy little kitty cat. 
the way you were biting me and attacking before. Just jealous because I'm streaming. What's up? Okay. He's being very chill right now. It is the duty of a nation to acknowledge and reward the loyal deeds of its people. Medals and trinkets are the only form we have, but we ask that you wear them proudly. Yes, ma'am. And thank you, Your Highness. I hear your accomplishments do not end with that knight's bravery either. The stories of your accomplishments suggest I owe you a great deal more than that. Lieutenant Welk and Gunther, step forward. In honor of your manner. Hi. Uh, is there retroactive medals that I am owed? That's a Gallia. May your allegiance to Gallia stand firm evermore. Pretty queer. Mm. Any new orders for me, Raiden? Hello again, son. I'm sorry. God. Come back, Raiden. Teach me the lightning bolt ninja. Orders, please. Oh, I. Ooh, okay. Well, exclusive scoop. Early in the morning of twenty third, Princess Cordelia was abducted, and taken forcibly from the grounds of Castle Rendries. A uh, subsequent investigation has shown the culprit was Federation Ambassador Townsend. In Galley, on an official visit after a banquet at the castle, he forced the princess into an armored vehicle, he prepared and made for the port. Thankfully, his escape was thwarted by members of Squad 7 and the Galleon Militia, who safely recovered the Princess Cordelia in time. The Galleon government has declined not to address this matter publicly, likely in an effort not to endanger relations with the Federation while Galleon remains locked in combat with the Empire's forces. Castle Rangri's audience hall saw an award ceremony on the 28th in which Militia Officer, Militia Officer Lieutenant Welke Gunther, age 22, was presented a prestigious Galleon Medal of Honor given to those who have gone above and beyond in the call of duty of service Above and beyond the call of duty in service of Gallia's interests, the Unicorn and Blazing Medal was presented by Princess Cordelia herself, who also graced the young soldier with wishes for his continued loyalty. After the ceremony, Gunther addressed the press, saying that he hoped to do right by this honor by becoming a better man and officer. The medal hung proudly around his neck. Uh, the Gunther family has the rare distinction of being among the first to receive the highest awards twice in as many generations. Want to expect it? Yeah, no worries, man. I'll be here for a while. We should go, you. Look at him around. Get some goo in your eye here. One second. Be here for a couple more hours at least. Oh, good quill. Very cute. Hey, there we go. Fifty thousand. Holy shit. The <laughs> jump up from the last one. Holy fuck. I need to do another well, skirmish or two go. to get any of the extra weapon upgrades here. Ooh, ooh, yeah, give me the accuracy. And I can't afford anything else. Forty-five thousand for all the gun upgrades. Thousand. Forty-five 
thousand thirty two plus thirty two thousand for the tank upgrades. Fuck. Come back. Oh, maybe this is. Welcome to your worst. Trade. You're better than this. <laughs> Good work. Looks like that. Okay, the snipers. I didn't get any new things for the snipers. Come back anytime you're ready to sweat. Let's see who the new dudes are, if there is any. Hello. Oh, and there are recruits. Melville, I like his uh, his mohawk. Yoko, uh, the old lady. Pretty good, but she's too good, so they only give her three potentials. Mm. Come back any good with the team I got for the moment. Do the next mission, and then I'll probably have to do uh three, four. The beach episode. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Doesn't look like there's a mission here, though. It's just a vacation episode. <laughs> Figured this has got to be big if they put out an emergency call, right? Oh, back into the field again? Militia ever heard of time off? I'm sorry to have called you here so early. I had news for Squad 7 of a pressing nature. The higher-ups were watching. Both during your recovery of the princess and elsewhere. In recognition of those accomplishments, you and I are being granted special leave. Ooh! That's great news. Are you serious? Music to my ears. How wonderful. There's more. We've been granted access to a stretch of shoreline owned by House Randgrees. Each vacation. <laughs> a stretch of shoreline? In other words, our orders are to cut loose and relax on a posh private beach. No way. That princess really knows how to up the morale, don't she? The whole place to ourselves. Talk about luxury. Hey, but what should I do? I don't own a swimsuit. Then come on, let's go shopping. I'll pick out something nice for you. Uh, okay. Wow, it's been years, huh? This should be fun, though, Ys. Yes. Very. We'll leave as soon as you're ready. You've earned this break. Enjoy it. Leo, you're so very warm on my legs. It's making my legs sweat. Cleo is a very cozy cat when I'm streaming, but like, because I have to fold my leg up crosswise so she has a good space to lay down on. She gets like very sunken in and then she just heats up. Wow. You can really tell this is a private beach. It's beautiful. World War II swimsuits. Places this well preserved around anymore. Alright, Cleo, I'm going off. Look at those white wings. Don't be mad. Oh. This, uh, swim suit was Rosie's idea. Really, I tried to tell her no. Of course, they gave the Just animated section for this. Pull it off. Um, what do you think? Do I look okay? Uh, it's great, actually. Great. You mean it? Huh? Uh, yeah. 
That is, you're, you're as pretty as a white-winged gull. I look like a seagull? Yeah, those wings are just gorgeous. Okay, so that was a compliment? Grabbing a cookie. I bet it was. A white-winged gull is just about my favorite bird. Okay, then thanks, Welkin. Someone's taking this private beach thing a little too literally. It's already hot enough as it is. Rosie! Don't try to pretend. You picked the raciest suit just for the lieutenant, the nervous some girls. Rosie, you're the one who told me to get Ooh. it. Oh, okay. come on! Someone's <laughs> going in the water. <laughs> okay, okay. Don't lose your top. Hey! Hey, Elks. Oh, hey, Ys. You having fun? I am. Been a while since we've come to the beach, hasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> that reminds me. Weren't you afraid of the wateries? I remember you clinging to that floaty porcabian. We tried to drag you out and you started bawling. Welkin. I was barely a toddler then. <laughs> right, sorry. You must be a great swimmer by now. That's... None of your business. Welks! Here goes, Welkin! Ah! Oh, the fucking pig rape. And down goes the boss. Man, those kids got too much energy. <laughs> You're sounding like an old man, Largo. What? I ain't that old. Oh, no. Then why did you just sound like my grandfather, hmm? Yeah, yeah. You sure you don't want to go for a swim? I thought you liked that. Nobody wants to see me running around in a skimpy suit like those kids. Not at my age. Whatever you say, Granny. You're no better than I am, are you? You haven't changed a bit since the day you enlisted. You still can't recognize a joke. Man, you still got a mouth on you. I think I'd keel over if that changed. <laughs> Thank you for the lovely compliment. Thank you, Kiki. Very humble, though. Come to think of it, didn't we all go to the beach just after we enlisted? Yes, we had a big seashell hunt competition. I don't think you found a single one. <laughs> I remember. Yeah, that was a wild time. <laughs> then Frederick winds up soaked to the bone. Largo. No Frederick stories. Oh. Hey. I'm I'm sorry. No. I should apologize. I'm going for a little walk. Over here! Pass the ball over here! Isara! Uh, okay. Blank. Hans, did I hit you with that? I'm so I hate the sorry. noises that pig makes. The like human imitating a. <laughs> she nailed the pig. Anime fake fantasy pig with wings. All by yourself, huh? Why don't you go join them? 
Nah, you have to play it cool, huh? <laughs> so what, did your journalist duties call you to the beach, or are you just bored? <laughs> Got me there. If I'm spending a day at the beach, I'd rather be with my boyfriend. Oh ho ho! You got yourself a boy, do ya? Color me jealous. Right? But there's times when I feel envious of you all, too. I interviewed a good chunk of Galia's army, but I didn't see any other units like yours. True comrades. The bond you guys have is really a cut above the rest. Hmm. <laughs> Get over there already. They're all waiting for you. Well, I could take pity on them. And it's not like chatting with an old married lady is any fun. <laughs> You're a piece of work. All right, guys, make room for me. Oh, a promising contender joins the fray. Rosie, think you could pair up with Isara? Bro, put the racist with <laughs> the person she's racist against. That's fucked up. What? Sure, fine. Isara, pull your weight or you're swimming. Okay. I'll do my best, Rosie. All right. Throw the ball, Isara. Okay. God, don't hit me with it. You're supposed to throw it that way. Rosie, did I hit you with that? I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds on purpose. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, I hate that fucking pig. It shows up a couple times, but I'm glad I don't have to deal with it too often. <sighs> Alright. Um... Oh, it's the outfit we get for him. That's what changed. The fucking... <laughs> That's what was new for his thing. I see. They got, like, the dress outfits and stuff now. Not that they got a new, uh... Uh, paragraph or anything, just their outfits change. Most often at home, nestled into a snug space. Often attempted to burrow his way into a shower's skull or shawl, or, or at least a scarf, much to the lady's displeasure. Welcome back. Kind of ace with a clear view, he's known for dropping everything to climb tall trees, came across some vices tales of the sky have always captivated him. Yeah, I like his Mohawk. <laughs> uh, Scott sends Scout, H19, full of more pep than he need know what to do with, he enlisted. Friendly and upbeat, quick to befriend pretty much anyone. Right. What's up, Lancer, age 37. 37? They drew her like a grandma. God. <laughs> it's like my age. <laughs> she ran a well-loved Rangria eatery until donated all the food in her larder to refugees one day and joined the militia. Best play strong big brother to Emile, but he's actually quite timid. Terrified of thunder and mice, he always keeps his distance from the kitchen. What the f- Definitely defeating an elite officer of the enemy opposing force. Okay. Wounded. <laughs> That's because I, I got wounded several times. I got that one. Okay. Uh... Alright. The Fuzin capture. Or recapture. Here is your mission brief. There's a lot to make sure stuff's straightened up. Nice. Being a good roommate. <laughs> Isn't messy, but tends to leave stuff in the couch in the general living area. Mm. Yeah, that kind of stuff's not too bad. I think that's general living stuff is fine if it's like 
once you guys are used to each other. But uh, if uh, if it's like first week moved in, nah, I just left all my dirty clothes on the couch. It's like okay, gross. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that kind of stuff is is at least something you can talk out and figure out, and not like oh, this guy's incapable of doing dishes after he cooks or something like that. That's something I find it, people have a really hard time learning that habit by if they haven't learned it by their 20s when they're moving in. Hoodies or DoorDash trash? Mm. Hoodies, not so bad. DoorDash trash? Yeah, that's. There's no excuse for that. <laughs> Back in the South, you muscle your way into foods in as quietly as you can. Alright. Foods in the belt of the Canyon, so the lay of land is highly varied. Check your map carefully in command mode. Simply to reach the destination point, Lieutenant. Okay. Contacting the inside won't be able to do much without you there. Find him at the labor camp as you in. Inside the city, you'll find stairs lights on the watch and trolley cars that you can ride along the rails. Okay. Light spot, you expect mortars or sniper bullets to start raining down. Try carefully in there. Darkness will be your best friend out there, but it will also mean limited visibility. Keep your eyes peeled. Hmm. This is not actually in the city yet, right? Questions? Let's Just get kind of trash. We take turns doing the dishes, take turns cooking and cleaning the kitchen, so that's fine with me. Yeah, put yourself in your room, yeah. I agree. Until so you're, like, comfortable with each other to start, like, Our top priority is to get to being the communal with that stuff. Squad seven, Which usually doesn't out. happen right after you move in. It takes a little while, right? <clears throat> Alright, let's see here. Well, this is Fousen. Looks like a complicated layout. Let's move carefully here. We don't want to be spotted. Oh, I see the searchlights over there. Oh, those are the rail cars. I see. I see how they have this laid out here. I barely remember this mission at all. Look, I don't I don't remember anything about this crazy canyon set up here. Take this rail car, go to here, sneak around under the lights. Maybe the crane? Hmm. Enemy camp. Just leave it to me. I thought an enemy spotted me. They can only fit one person, but they may get you behind the enemy. 2007 or 2008, I think? Let me check. Tank command, move out! PS3 game. Watch your back out there. 2008, yeah. The front lines made enemy contact. Support them. If I remember correctly, getting over here is a really good way to get past that, but... Okay. Egg first. Go. It's roughly oh, no, safe, at least. Ah, sniper. Ah, this whole place reeks of them. Enemy sight. Fucking racists talking again. I love nature. Fire! 
Yeah, they did a good job of... Because of how they stylized it. Because it's got this, like, watercolor aesthetic and, like, anime cell shading. You get away with using really low, low-res models. And, uh... Because of that, they could do a better job with, like, having good details on their, like, armor and weapons and stuff like that. It did a... It was a very smartly made game. I, I can appreciate it for that. Uh, here, let's see, like, uh, she's got the night sight stuff, so. And yeah, the mechanics of it are just, like, one of a kind. I love it. Big fan. Ooh, eh? Well, let's blast this motherfucker in the back of the head. Yeah. I agree, too. It's quite well. One of my favorites. Oh, I see anti-personnel mines there. I see one. Number four, the one they did on PS4, is just like a strict improvement on just about everything in, compared to this game. I think the story's a little less good, but they they did a good job of. Uh, Updating the mechanics and making like more strategic stuff to it, and there's a couple new classes and stuff, but uh, it's also quite a bit longer, like a lot Let's longer. Oh, we have to like send the fucking carts back around. I see. Tank command, move out. Yeah, the style suits it very well. It's like simplistic, but like it looks good for what it is. And you can get away with a little bit of like aged filter on top of stuff because of that. Just watch this. Tactical RPG, that's probably a good way to put it. I don't know if there was like a really good genre to, genre to put this in. Alright! <laughs> Cause it's like, you do have active portions where they shoot at you and you have to like literally run to dodge bullets, take cover, shoot back and stuff, but the, the actual like shooting and stuff is all done in like RPG time basically. <laughs> also have night sight stuff. Oh wait, she can't go across there, can she? Unless she can just run across this? No. Oh, Hurts moved. But yeah, they all have unique, like, uh, potentials and attitudes and specialities and characters they work well with and uh, all sorts of fun stuff, so... The scout probably can see me soon. Triangle strategy is tactical RPG. Yeah, uh, I'd still call triangle strategy just like a straight up RPG. It's just Final Fantasy Tactics, but modernized a little bit with the Octopath engine. Moving out. Hmm. Can't beat the smell of fresh soil. Do, 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 do. Oh shit. Maybe go back. Can't beat the smell of fresh soil. Shots on this guy's head. Now. I mean, it's tactical RPG is so I'd fire on the game second to find us. Yeah, I guess. I don't know, like, tactics games are its own, like, thing, right? I don't know if. The, it's weird to call them that. <laughs> Oh, 
that's a sniper, that's why I was like, I thought that was a scout. Hank over there, too. Oh, is he gonna get on the trolley? Entering combat. Maybe you call one ready to use. <laughs> yeah, in my head, I've never even thought about them being like a tactical anything. Just tactics. Please don't follow the Oh, I can't see that other enemy unless he hid somewhere. Oh, I put that too far away. Oh, fuck. I didn't even hit him. No problem, that guy's a sniper. You shouldn't have any problem taking him out. I see one. Poor people. We'll be there to help Is that a sniper as well? It is. Okay. Oh my god, so many snipers up here. Uh, no. Keep going. Leave that one to me. They can't attack me anyways, so... Not while I'm moving. Don't look down. You'll only panic. I don't remember if that... brain has anything to do with stuff, but... I feel like it has to, right? Oh shit, it's as far as she can go. Oh, uh, there's the other guy. Shock trooper over there. Okay. Oh, their machine guns are so, like, low range. I'm on my way now! Ooh. Oh, he's just <laughs> clipping into invisible hitbox of the posts. Everybody leave you when you're. Oh, always man. Have a good night. I I've been trying to make it earlier too because I actually work in the mornings now. The hunt begins. So, I am. <laughs> I definitely should be calling it fairly soon myself, but. Uh, it's good seeing you, good there. hearing from you again. And yeah, two, two and a half weeks, I'll have uh, Unicorn Overlord going as well. So, I'm back again for then. <laughs> or every like other day or third day, I'll be doing uh, the uh, stuff for this game to triangle strategy back and forth. So, <clears throat> no problem, right. boss. They got some snipers. Of the dark. Just ghosts. Enemy spotted. Bang, bang. Uh, I was hoping she could hit that other sniper as well. So she can see everything right now. Right? Tank. A couple guys over there. Oswald the Iron Scout. Okay. Two snipers with posts, a couple shock troopers, and the sniper. I'll make it work. No grass to hide in over here. Ugh. Right. Let's take out the sniper then. He can more than you're playing it. Nice. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Right, here I go. Keep an eye on the notifications. I changed it up finally to. Some random DMC quotes. <laughs> so <laughs> you're doing well. Just keep it up. Yeah, I can 
keep uh, out of eyes of those guys from here. <laughs> Maybe. So you might be in danger over there. Just watch this. Hang him with a headshot from a distance. Yeah. Fuck. I'll try my best. All units, what? Ooh, triple support. Not on those guys. Okay, this one it is then. I'll help too. Hell yeah. Any of the shock way. troopers coming up here are gonna get fucked up. Keep her where she is and hope they didn't spot Ika hiding over there. <laughs> Oh, they just passed her. Okay. Here we go. I gotta keep those spotlights in them too. Hostile sighted. Be careful. If they get those searchlights on you, you'll be dodging mortars. Avoid the lights at all costs. If they find you, take evasive action immediately. Try to conserve ammunition when you can. This one circles. That one goes back and forth on the main route. Alert! That Alert! one goes up and down the bridge. Please continue advancing. The target is up See their range as soon as hopefully they don't fucking get me here. Push forward. At least they're kinda slow, so there's not really a Do you still have sufficient ammo? Oh, I can almost get them both in this. Let's try to between them. It'd be funny if the search don't, like searchlights don't react to the corpses, but yeah, it's fine, it's fine. The next move is probably them yet? get myself between the buildings over there. Do you have a visual on the enemy? I want to see how far this goes over there. Maybe I could park up beside the building. Tank command, move out. Mm, maybe not, but. Here we go. Uh oh, uh, I Don't fucked down. it up. Why? Why is it turning that way? Oh no! Fucking! Oh fuck! Okay. Fucking tank, move the way I want you to move. Jesus. <laughs> Out of ammo. There we go. Oh, I can't hit anything from here. Ah! Okay. Fuck that up. So there's a tank down there, unfortunately. Right, here I go. Get her down there at least. Yeah. Oh, you can back up, Cleo. Good girl. No actual action to do with this. Don't look down. You'll only panic. Enemy spot. Whoa. We'll be there in a minute. Hold out 
Tank command, move out. I feel like that crane is something wrong with it, but I don't remember. Alright. Let's get the scouts moving up. I'll make this look good. Don't get stuck in the mortar range. Don't get stuck in the mortar range. Oh, that spotlight froze at least, though. That's interesting. It's the bridge, bro. Oh wait, mortar. Uh... Yeah, he's safe over here. Just enough movement to do it. <laughs> okay, and three left. Need the sniper to get fucking moving along too. So bad. Alright! They're almost as good as the scouts for movement, luckily. My turn, okay? Exposed to the tank, it's okay. Probably. It's easy. gonna get spotted by a searchlight. Make good use of cover as you proceed. Just gonna take the, the hits here and move the tank along. Entering combat. He's probably very vulnerable to the spotlights, but that's okay. The rest of this, I'll use to move the slow fuckers along. I see you clear as day. What the fuck? Oh, for the tank. Oops. Did I just put him in mortar range? Ah, goddammit! <laughs> yeah, I did. I thought he could make it across the bridge, but... Let's do this thing. Well, if he dies, they'll pick him up. Here. Everybody else needs their full movement to, to, like, actually make a difference here. Yuck! 
done. I don't think I should have shot that. I want that rail card <laughs> to, to stay alive. Uh-oh. Did I put him in range of the border too? Uh-oh. Alex got fucked up a little bit there. Did he die? Oh, Largo took a hit too. Minor damage sustained. Okay. Oh, they'll they survive the hit. Good. Actually, you know what? Tank has Entering to move before combat. this fucking spotlight gets it again. Immediately. Okay. Have you sighted them yet? Hostile sighted. Stay close out there. Seven headshots would do it. One headshot with the main cannon. Now. Eh, not bad. Oh, he almost fucking flew off the bridge. Oh my god. Leave that one to me. So when you come through these a second time, if you have Alicia like fully maxed out from the first playthrough, she can just like solo most of these missions in like one turn. It's crazy how good she is later. Oh fuck. Damn it. <laughs> uh, yeah, she's kind of like out of the range. She might actually be okay there. First things first. No problem, okay. boss. You're close enough to actually help. Uh. Somebody go swat those flies down. Do you have enough moves to get to the... Probably not. It's just... Crossfire bad guys moving in the, the camp over there. Two scouts move. Smell of fresh soil. I'll let the sniper take another movement. All units, watch your surroundings. Enemy units spotted. Ooh, oh, fuck. Oh, that Lancer's still alive? Oh, he was hiding in the, the thing. That's funny. What are you fucking doing down there, man? Does like five damage to him because they got blast proof armor. Scout and a uh, guy over there. I'll make this look good. Reactivated the mortar, so we might as well take the shortcut. That's what I wanted. Triple. 
You fuck tank guy. <laughs> Scouts aren't like super lethal, but three of them plus the tank aiming down that way should be good. But I'm a little worried they're exposed to all the snipers that are up there. Uh, all right. Got that spotlight right now. Can you see them from here? Or where they would be? Where they're supposed to be placed here. Maybe just along there. Take a pot shot. Oh, I hit one. There we go. Scout reinforcement, eh? Oh man, if they just hunker down, Tank will get to fire a mortar in there and then they'll all be dead. That'll be great. That's Ramona. Ow. Why didn't that guy shoot from cover? <laughs> he covers after. One that came up there, huh? Three of you, I think. Fire! Oh, that one survived. Good job, Stark Trooper. Good work. Keep it up. Spotlight goes how far? I got to have to drive through it eventually. Try to leave a path for people. Fuck, they're so far behind, I don't even know if it's worth moving them along right now. Just let the... The recall order get them or something once I capture this base here. Those poor people. They'll be there to help soon. Perfect. Get them. Huh, here we go. Count me in. Just overkill. That makes things a bit easier. Oh, she's full too. Keep out of the way of snipers. Capture the base. Ica, I'll send you along the track. We're coming to help. Doo -doo -doo. Good. On to the next target. Keep abreast of the situation. I could just rush over there, but I want to see if there's any goodies hidden around here, like secret enemies and stuff, so. No problem, boss. Have you do the loop, Ica. Maybe, uh. Yeah! there. 
Okay. This isn't what they told us. They said it was safe here. Leave that one to me. I see one. Nice. See the anti personnel mines there, though. I see one. Oh, shit. Stay, stay in there and uh, don't, don't poke your head out for them to get you. We gotta just keep an eye on those things. I can't see around the corner there. So there's a lancer and a tank. Cheat once, fuck. Let's do right. this thing. Lago and Rosie, you're gonna run up the hard way. Cause you give me command points at least while you're still out here. And uh, Alex, I'm just Wait. gonna abandon there for now. Alicia would get torn the fuck up by the that one over there. Maybe they can't see me from that far away yet. They can't, okay. This guy even gonna make it one go? God damn. force him to get blown away by uh, the mortar fire while he's waiting there, so. Oh, 
Now the other guys are around the corner there. There might be another one here. I'm fine. Really. Enemy spotted. Well, Enemy this is spotted. not a sub Oh, two Lancers are there. Oh boy. Keep an eye on your allies for right here. I see one. Uh Fucked up, guy. Uh oh, run away! Twenty-two health, eh? I wish you could take him out, even though it's a pretty tight match between the three of them right now. Uh, hmm. Oh, he's waiting for that from there. My turn, okay? Hmm. Can't beat the smell of fresh soil. Literally twenty-two full shots together. Now. Pull it together. Close. Yes. Three headshots to kill him. That one's a, just far enough away that he takes more. God damn. Can't stick this guy then. Nice, good shots on shit. Target silenced. Head to the next one. Did she just recall the fucking thing? No. Can't beat the smell of fresh soil. Alright, I could take a chance on you. You can do it. Ooh, this guy better not fucking dodge. Over. Yeah, good stuff. Perfect. Enemy unit neutralized. We're clear to advance. Oof. You know what? It's not worth her dying. I'm just gonna tuck her back in there. Make a move finally. Underminer fire. Minor damage sustained. Damage minimal. Ow. I can just run all the way down there now. Oh, she doesn't have a way down. I see. Try to act as soon as you start it. In that case, just fuck this guy up. There we go. Perfect. Enemy unit neutralized. Go hang out by the crane, I guess, where it's mostly safe. Ooh, I am a little fucked up, but... Minor damage sustained. The labor cap is up ahead. Continue your... <laughs> Blocking its machine gun fire for my, uh... Guys to move in is kind of the biggest deal at the moment. Roger. Oh, still sneaks past a bit. Been waiting. 
Can the Largo make it there? I don't know. Got it close. Try not to miss it. Oh, fuck. Hell yeah, there we go. All right. Now Alicia can just run at home. Before the mortar strike happens, we'll get out of here. We'll be there in a minute. Hold out till then. Why does it have a thing over there? Is there gotta be somebody over there too? Hiding in the grass, maybe. Tank command, move out. Oh, does it mean the tank has to be here? God damn it. Okay. I can move the tank and, and Niels out of the danger zone at the very least. Oh shit, there's another one. Right, okay. Here we go. You can get out of that mortar range, can't you? Good, good guy. There you go. Nature. There we go. I didn't have to get the people there, I had to get the tank there. I'm glad I forcibly made the tank move further a couple times. Go to fit the enemy units. Complete up the chapter without losing anybody. Hell yeah. Seize the machine gun. Metal. Cool. I'll view up the stories till the next mission, and then I'll call it there for the night. Try to be an early sleep. you folks here and how'd you get in welkin gunther is my name i was told there was a militia sympathizer here well you heard right welkin i'm your guy i'm zaka it's nice to meet you hey pumpkin i've got to talk some adult stuff with these folks would you be a good girl and go to bed for me <sighs> okay Good night. She's sweet. She your kid's sister? No. Both her parents died a while back. They were victims of torture. Torture? That's just horrible. Listen, we have a lot of work to do. Follow me, let's get started. As you can see, Thousands factories are located on the canyon's edge, split between an upper and lower level. There's an armored train that services those factories. It moves on rails built into the upper level, shooting downward. If it's up there, it's completely out of our range. How do we attack it? Glad you asked. We take it down with this little wonder. It's a Ragnite bomb. I made it myself. I've been sneaking spare parts from under the Empire's watch for weeks. I can guarantee its power. 
You think one bomb's gonna blow this thing up? I'm not proposing we use it on the train. We use it on this. I get it. We take out the rails. Then the train drops into the canyon from the bridge. Exactly. You can leave the setting of the bomb to me. I want all of you to provide a diversion so I can get in there and attach the package to a strut. Once I've wired it and gotten a safe distance away, I'll give you a signal. Then you'll detonate it and destroy the bridge. Right. Sounds good. Did you have any questions about the mission then? No, I got it. Is there something else? Forget it. Oh, I get it now. She's racist, yeah. <laughs> You're wondering if you can trust me because I'm a Darkson, yeah? <laughs> if you don't mind me asking, tell me something you like. What? Something you enjoy. There's gotta be something, right? Um, singing, I guess. I like to sing and listen to other folks. Oh, musician, huh? Nice. I like to sing too. Nothing beats a nice tune and a little stroll. Music can pick you up or make you cry. <laughs> Anthems can drive a whole country to war. That's the great thing about music. Variety. Every song is different, but it's all good. Yeah, I guess so. So what are you getting at? If you appreciate diversity in music, why hate all the Darksons? What? There's plenty of races in the world. Each has its traits, but people are all unique. Just like with music. They've all got their good points. Well, I think so anyway. Singing's more fun with a chorus, right? I agree, Zaka. There are over 30,000 kinds of beetles in the world, each with its own characteristics. Bug freak, right? <laughs> it's the same for us, too. Ugh. Another one of the boss's nature talks. Beetles? <laughs> wow, that's a new one. I never heard a man compare people to bugs in a good way before. I'd have to agree, though. Bickering won't do us any good. Let's try to make nice. Hmm. Okay. The operation begins tomorrow at dawn. I want everyone ready for combat. She does eventually come around to not being quite so fucking racist to them, but I don't like what it takes to get her there. The other seven or eight guys in the crew that are like Darkson haters, and I'm like, all right, just never using you guys. <laughs> you stay in the sidelines forever. Hey, why the long face? You worried? Oh, Mr. Zaka, I just can't believe it. Believe what? I'd heard stories of the concentration camps, about the harsh labor forced upon detainees. But seeing it happen in person, I... It just seems too cruel to be true. Yeah. But this is the truth. I... The world is no friend of the Darksons. That's the truth of it. And this war has stirred up prejudice in people, so they behave inhumanely. I can sympathize with wanting to look away, but facing the truth makes a person grow. Mr. Zaka. And hey, we're still young. Let's enjoy life. It's up to us to change other folks' minds. Yes, you're right. Thank you, Mr. Zaka. As long as we don't stop reaching out, the day will come when others will accept us. Funny how I've had this little box here because she likes sleeping in it, sitting on the floor since I moved here. And soon as she hasn't sat in it once even since but i brought up the little table and put it beside me again and she jumped right back in like immediately she was happy to now, sit up near me the mission cute. starts at dawn make sure you get some rest i will good night mr zaka 
I like Zack and Isara quite a lot. Two of my favorite characters. Okay. <clears throat> Let's check the headquarters stuff and upgrade what I can. And ah, you motherfucker. I hope we'll meet again. Be some skills that Snake taught you, Ryden. Sword and shield. Cool. I don't know what I got that one for, but bronze arms of Galio. Fancy one. Order of the Holy Shield Award. Furthermore, for your squad's exemplary performance in the final battle, this royal award. Final battle? What? Thank you, Your Highness. Oh, I got a special lance. Cool. May your allegiance... I forgot she gives you cool weapons. I thought you only picked them up in the thing. Throw it on somebody. I got four of them too? Hell yeah. Oh, that's just... Got a range. Ooh, I like the damage. If the accuracy went up, I'd probably take it. You know what? Range. Give me the next version, princess, and then I'll be good. Hurts? No. Come back. Well, train. Of aid, that's nice. Come one. Well, I think before that last mission would have been like fifty five thousand to get all the current stuff that was there. Gotta get at least the tier two ones for all of these. Oh, firepower gets a range as well, huh? Okay. And more shots. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, so the the one on the right, pretty sure is like a much larger clip. Again 
I will call it there. Oh, time to overwrite. Start from this way and do it the proper direction. <laughs> Have a good night. Stay safe, stay so healthy. Uh, tomorrow is Wednesday. I will probably stream Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and I think Saturday, Sunday. At least Sunday I will, but Saturday maybe I'll devote time to reorganizing the room here, making it a little more usable and stream 